What's up, guys? Welcome back, guys. Welcome to another episode of Customs of the Week. I'm Jason. This is Dylan. We're on episode six now, and it's a pretty pretty cool episode this week. We yeah. have the top custom Yeezy 350 V2s, and we have some people that we've actually haven't talked about right. who have made a huge impact on the Yeezy community. So this should be a cool episode. Yeah, I think one thing that we'll go over this episode is how do people utilize this silhouette? There's yeah, a lot of definitely. different things you can do. You mm. can play with just the stripe. You can possibly do some all over stuff. So we got some really unique mm -hmm. variations today. So let's go ahead and dive into it. All right, so kicking things off, we have Mosh using Cause's Silent City painting series on this pair of V2s. And man, these came out crazy where he did both of the outsides of the shoe mm -hmm. with the painting. Obviously, you could recognize that this is Cause right away from the color palette to the X's. And I think one of my favorite parts of these is how he has the X across the toes as, and on the side where he didn't paint anything, he used the, like the opposite side of the Right, of right. The and then he used yeah. the negative portion of the X mm -hmm. on the outside portions where he did do the painting. So mm -hmm. super cool, unique touch there. Yeah, it reminds me of like a very colorful, like mosaic, like cubic kind of mm -hmm. pattern. Mm -hmm. uh, it works really well. And he, I think he, like, he did a really good choice by not painting the back tag right. and whatnot. Like, there's right. just like stuff like that. Right. And also the liner, like he did a really, yeah. that's like really- Keeping that white. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just right. because you just kind of don't want to touch mm -hmm. that part. Cause it's always been being touched and used. So right. Eventually like right. wore away. Right. And usually I think we definitely lean towards keeping Yeezys a little bit more minimal, mm -hmm. but these came out awesome. And these are definitely kind of the exception to the rule type piece. Next up we have C's EMC and he threw this sick Shogun theme on top of it. Like just, you know, one picture isn't enough to really mm -hmm. just like see all the details yeah. and all the designs on this. Mm -hmm. It's basically a tattoo just in different Great way like, to all, put it. on all kinds of on all different sizes of shoe. Great way to put you it. You have the skull with the skull the, the skull with the mm -hmm. sword going through mm -hmm. it. You have some teeth on the inside of that one. Oh and then the color Crazy. you know everything just like really stands yeah. out. Yeah. Like I, it's really hard to get that boldness yeah. on uh, on that texture yeah. on the prime knit. Yep. So Great you know, job. Great job at executing that. When reading up on these a little bit more, he said that he was trying to capture the imagery that could bring you back to the battlefields of Nagashino. And like you said, man, there's a cherry blossom mm -hmm. tree on fire behind that katana piercing through the skull. Um, I love the rising sun look on the outside of the left shoe. Mm -hmm. Just so many cool things about this and it definitely has that tattoo feel. So he totally nailed these. And next up, we have Kendra's Customs with a really cool pair of Birds of Paradise done on the cream Yeezys. And I love how these came out. That Birds of Paradise look, obviously from the Givenchy collab a few years back. Um, just that minimalism look on here. She totally nails it. Just the, just how that color pops up mm -hmm. against that cream base. Great job. And like you're saying, like the color needs to pop on something so minimal because yeah. everything is uh, it's minimal. Yeah. You know? So you need something to just to just kind of give it that like oomph. Yep. You know what I mean? Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. So she did a great job. And also the pictures look great. Yeah. And that's something Kendra's also like. She also just nails the pictures all the time. All the time. Yeah. And I mean, just looking at the shading within the mm -hmm. flowers and stuff, like it's just incredible how good these are. That this is kind of one of those that, you know, as an artist myself, I look and I go, man, she did a great yeah. job yeah, really achieving that look on this mm -hmm. prime knit. So killer work here. So next up we have Vab and you do this sick Joker theme on top of the cream Yeezys. Just every every little detail about it is just mm -hmm. amazing. Like yeah. the, the green on the on the sock liner. Yep. Nailed and it. then you have like the wording and like in red. Yeah. You have obviously the Joker's mouth and then you have his eyes. Yep. Um, right away, it's a very, like you said, it's a very grungy theme, mm -hmm. and it kind of has it's like a kind of like a variation of Castles, like how right. he does the mouth and everything, wrapping kinda, around, yeah, from wrapping the around the toe, right? And, right. and he does a really good job of just adding extra details mm -hmm. to it, and really making mm -hmm. it a character in itself. There's a few things that I think most customizers like definitely want to do when they know they're going to Joker theme. So you want to, mm -hmm. you know, play with the mouth. You want to add some green from the hair. You want to add some of the laughing writing, the ha ha ha. Mm -hmm. You want to have some of the purple hexagon from the shirt he's wearing. You know what I mean? So I think he kind of nails all of that, and these just have that really grungy look. So that's pretty cool to see that on a Yeezy. Mm -hmm. All right, so last and definitely not least, our final spot we're actually gonna be giving to an artist himself rather than just one shoe because our buddy Brennan over at Bison Customs absolutely nails customizing the Yeezy mm -hmm. 350 V2s. He's done so many and he has a very signature style of doing the tiny characters along the stripe. He's done literally countless pairs of some of Kanye's albums, some Toy Story stuff, some Cartoon Network stuff. Mm -hmm. Powderpuff Girls, Kids Next Door, 
Kid Seat Ghost from Kanye's albums, Graduation, just so many cool, yeah. unique things, man. Every, and you can, like you said, it's just his style. Like yeah. everything you, all the little cartoons, mm -hmm. you can, if you see it, you know, you know it's, it's Bison. Like, yep. You know right away it's him. Yep. So he does a really good job mm -hmm. at creating his own brand and mm -hmm. just really, you know, kind of in a way watermarking yep. his, right. his designs. Right, totally, totally. And he plays up the stripe, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? So take advantage of some of the contours and stuff that you get when mm -hmm. working on a different silhouette. And he's absolutely mastered yeah, that when it comes to definitely. working on the V2s. So thank you guys for staying with us for another episode of Customs of the Week. Um, this coming week, we actually have two huge episodes that huge. we've been working on. Like this one we're releasing Tuesday. Tuesday? Mm -hmm. Tuesday's we've, video. Um, we've been working on it for the past three days now. Yeah. Non-stop. It's non-stop and it's just, you know, it's a lot of footage, it's a lot of time, but mm -hmm. I think now, it's gonna be our best yeah, video. It's a, yeah, it's gonna I, be our I, best I would video. say so. I would mm -hmm. say so. And this is something that we believe you guys would like. Yeah. And since you know we're here to do this for you guys, mm -hmm. we're like you know whatever. Let's just do it. Let's yep. just put in the let's work do it. and let's yep. get it out there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So we're excited for what's to come this week. If you guys haven't already, go ahead and make sure you check out last week's video. We had another two minute Tuesday teaching you guys how to do a digi camo pattern. And then we had episode five of the Custom Cleat Chronicles featuring Geronimo Allison of the Green Bay Packers. So a couple weeks away from football mm -hmm. season. So, you know, that means crazy things for us. So we're excited. So thank you guys for sticking with us for another episode. We really appreciate that. Your guys' support within this series has been huge. So thank you guys. Make sure you give this video a like. Make sure you're subscribed to the page. And we will see you guys next week.